Gotta try to keep all this alive for her. Take care of all the plants a little better and just get it back to uh, the way she would have loved to see it. Jeffrey Fold's wife, Nicole, loved decorating their backyard. She just was just a, a ray of sunshine, a heart of gold. On November 14th, Nicole, Jeffrey, their kids, and some friends were hanging out and had a fire going in the backyard. Accidents do happen and they can ruin your life. The fire fizzled out and Fold says his wife tried to reignite it. Put another log on it and uh, I guess, you know, there wasn't much flame at all, but she just, I guess, felt to pour a little gas on it and it would reignite, and it did. And I guess it must have traveled the gas stream up to the gas can and it exploded in her hands. The explosion hit Nicole and their son. Paramedics airlifted both to Tampa General. Fultz says his wife suffered burns to 95% of her body, and their son has second degree burns to close to 40% of his body. She wanted the stackable, and we just made it to the second year, so. I just got her a second one, and it was going to be many more. Nicole died three days later on the fourth anniversary of their engagement. Everyone in my life that I've known has pretty much done what she did, and, uh, you know, it's not uncommon. It's not the smartest thing to do, but everybody does it, and uh, don't. <laughs> just think twice, you know. It, like I've said before, I don't want to see this happen to somebody else. Their son spent 12 days in the hospital. He recently got home and is starting to recover, Bolt says. Bolt says the support from the community has been overwhelming. Nicole's co-workers at Tarpon Tavern, where she was a manager and a server, started a fundraiser for the Foltz family. Everybody loved her to death. All the customers, they would come in. You know, when she would come in, she was the type of person that lit up the room. In Tarpon Springs, Kaylee Tracy, Fox 13 News. Fold says they're going to turn the fire pit into a birdbath, something Nicole always wanted for their backyard.